Good morning, you guys, and welcome to a new vlog. Today is Monday, and I don't know when this vlog is going up. It might go up today, tomorrow, depending how much I film this morning. Um, I'm behind because I didn't film all weekend. I was going to film yesterday, but I was so tired when we got home. So over the weekend, we actually went and visited family. We stayed at my parents. So I don't know. I was going to vlog, but you know me. I always try to, but it doesn't happen because I... I just want to enjoy the moment, you know what I mean? It's so different sometimes, like, when you're trying to vlog and get footage of things. And you you really can't just, like, enjoy, you know? So anyways, yeah, I, I got a little bit of footage, so I'll insert them right now. of what we did this weekend is just pretty much we went to the park um, with his grandparents and stuff and he really enjoyed that a lot so yeah um, anyways I also did go to TJ Maxx like I had a little bit of a me time it was like an hour of shopping um, and I went there to look for just like home things um, so I got a few things for Liam's room actually so I was able to find crib sheets. I have a few crib sheets for him that I like alternate um, between, but he needs more or like he needs new ones um, since, you know, I've had those since he was little and stuff like that. So I got him new ones um, at TJ Maxx. This was $9.99. A set of two. Isn't that so cute? I love the pattern with the line and I like how it's neutral and it's a set of two, which is nice. Uh, so yeah, I guess you know, went to TJ Maxx and browse and ended up finding things. Um, got him a new blanket. This I absolutely love. It's the 100% cotton. It's always the ones that says made in India. They're just the softest blankets. I have a few of these in Liam's room. And yeah, I guess we like them a lot. I've washed the ones we have and it it's perfect and I, I just love the quality of these blankets so yeah I got him one with dinosaurs he hasn't seen this yet so he's gonna be so excited because if you know him he loves dinosaurs okay um the only thing that's in here is for me everything else I've like put away so I'll show you around um and see what those are um I did find me a bra new bras I like these ones <laughs> These were in the kids section, okay? Like, your girl has tiny boobs, so this should fit me. Hopefully, we'll, we'll see. Um, but yeah, I like how it doesn't have underwire, so I, I picked them up. This was only $5.99 for two, so that's so cheap. And then I saw this on clearance, and I was like, yes, okay. So, do you see the colors? Shorts, and this one is like... Like a sweater. I think it's a cropped. It's meant for like working out or something. Or just like lounging around in. So I was like, oh my god, this is perfect. Even this pajamas and it was on clearance for 16 I mean, it was 20 so you're saving like $4. Not a whole lot. Like not a big of a discount. But for two things for 16 like it's so cute. I love, love the shorts. Like this is definitely going to be, yeah. I actually went with a medium because... The top for the small looked just so cropped, and I was just like, mm, let's, let's not do that. Um, so I went with a medium, and I figure um, the bottoms has a drawstring anyways. <clears throat> Excuse me. So I can totally just tighten it to my waist. So it'll, it'll fit. It'll, it'll work out. So that's everything that's in my little 
reusable bag because everything else I have already put away so let me show you okay so one of the things that i got at tj maxx is this pillow right here it's really <laughs> it's like super puff like it's stiff you guys like this thing is a full like wow but it's so cute and it was on clearance for 13 and i was like i'm gonna just get it it's so cute for just like just decor look how cute that looks <laughs> It's so big. Um, also, don't mind my nails. Look at that. They were lifting already. And I just did them, like, what, like a week ago? Um, it was lifting around the edges. I don't know if it's the product that I use or it's just, you know, I the way I did it. But I um, filed it down. And I, don't, I haven't decided yet if I'm going to just fill or if I'm going to redo the whole thing. So I'm just kind of leaving it like this for now until I make up my mind. Okay, so that's that. And then... I got this new, um, it's called a utility cart, uh, but I'm using it, as you can see, for my cutter station because I've been just working with one cutter this past few months and it takes me a long time um, to, what's it called, to make stickers and cut and everything. So I was like, all right, let me set up my other cutter. I have four of these, so I mean... Yeah, I don't know. I don't want all four, so I'm just like, let me just do two. And it fits so good in these um, cards. I wasn't going to put this, but this bar you can, like, take off. But the paper actually goes right underneath it, which is good. And then I got these. Can you see it? It's, like, acrylic. Um, they're just, like, pieces of acrylic. I think it's, like, 6 by 12 or 6 by. I don't know the size. But I'll link it below, but... I put it under the cutter so it kind of has this this much in front of it so when the paper comes through here it's not gonna fall down it'll just kind of like yeah because usually I just use a ruler <laughs> but I thought this was you know it's nice looking right so yeah that's I set that up last night this little thing I like made all the wires so they go in this clear bucket instead of um, having a dangle all over in the back um, so yeah all the wires are organized and well this is as organized as it gets but yeah and then I also got more mailers I ran out since our launch so we got more mailers and I love these so much more than the other ones that I was getting um, because these are like a lighter pink it's more like a blush for some reason like I ordered it from the same manufacturer but for some reason this is lighter than that but that's okay that's okay um, what else? What else? What else? Oh, did I show you guys this? I don't know if I showed you that. Um, that I also found at TJ Maxx, like, a week or so ago. And it was only, like, $14. And Grace said you can find the same one at con the container store for a little bit more. Um, but yeah, I love it because it organizes all of my little stickers. And I can see which one I have and what I don't have. Like, I don't have these two right here. Um, so I have to make more of those. Um, but yeah, so excited about that. So cute. And there's just my little setup right there. I have to put more planner or agenda covers up there to, like, stock it up. But that's pretty much that. Oh, I was also reorganizing my drawers. So I got these. Um, organizers which I will be using these in the bathroom um, but I'll show you that later um, but I found these at Target it was a set of three for two dollars as you can see there's four here because I used the other ones and then I got this size as well so yeah you get three in a set for two dollars these I got like at the dollar spot years ago this one I got I think Walmart came with that but I like these more because they're white and they're like this squishy kind of material. So you can kind of squish them. Let me show you. So I organized this drawer with that. And they just fit so nicely. I love it. So that's all organized like that. I also reorganized this. This is going to be hard to show you because I can't pull it all the way out. But I have like the this size containers back here. So there's four of them there. And they just fit so nicely. And then these are the ones that I got at Walmart. This is what I use for my pens. So, yeah, that's that. Liam's over there with his breakfast. Um, but I also got this crystal at TJ Maxx. 
Isn't it so pretty? And it was only $10 for this. I don't know where it's going to go yet. Pro most likely um, on my desk or something. But I washed it last night because, you know, crystals, they get a little bit, um, what's it called? Like they have some fallout in their packaging and stuff like that. So I just washed it in just water. So there's that. I think it's so pretty and so cheap for $9. Love it. I love how it's standing up. All the other ones were little sticks laying down and I don't like those. <laughs> I actually have packages as well so i'll open that with you okay first up urban decay they sent over their vice lipsticks there's a lot in here like a lot a lot <clears throat> vegan lipsticks and lip glosses and there's a bunch in here so I'm not going to open them. I will look and see what I have and what I don't have, what I want to keep. And then I think we'll do a giveaway later on, like maybe next week once I put everything together. But we got a bunch of lipsticks, you guys. Like here are some of the colors you can see there. We have glossies and mattes. We also have here lip glosses. I don't know if you can... Some of the colors so yeah we have really good color range i'm pretty excited about that so that's really nice of them to send over um just to, like for me to try out like some of these a lot of these pr packages um that i do get i don't have to do videos on or anything like that it's just you know once like you've built kind of like a relationship with a brand they will just gift you and you can post about it if you want or you can like not <laughs> it really depends on you they're not like forcing you to do anything which is so kind you know what i mean like i totally appreciate that so these brands you know if i can i will definitely you know post about it and support them and stuff like that like i just think it shows a lot you know when a brand does that same with it cosmetics i've worked with them in the past and since working with them They've always been so kind to send over things. So I'm very appreciative of that. And they sometimes they can send over so much stuff that I'm just like, all right, we're going to do a giveaway because your girl doesn't use all the things, you know? Like, we don't want them to go bad. So anyways, um, a cosmetic sent over new skincare. I'm so excited. Um, this came in last week, and I've been wanting to open it. So here we go. Oh, these are their new um, serums. Okay, okay. So I absolutely love their lotions, like their face moisturizers and the neck cream. Those are my favorites. I really, I also really like the eye cream, but I haven't used that one as much um, as the face moisturizer and the neck creams. So I can't say much about it, but I'm excited about these because they're kind of like in the same line. So it's called the um, Bye Bye Serums. Isn't that cute? So. Let me just... Oh my gosh, there's so much in here. Okay. Okay, so we have all the Bye Bye Serums. And each one is $29. And it is available at cosmetics.com and Ulta Beauty in July 2021. So I will link all of that down below for you. So I have the Bye Bye Serum, which is the vitamin C. Right? Am I correct? Oh, vitamin E. And it has 15% vitamin C. This is the one with hyaluronic acid. This one has the glycolic acid. And this one has the niacinamide. So all four of these. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much, It Cosmetics. I'm so excited to try this out, especially the hyaluronic acid. Oh, it's going to be so nice. I'm going to have to read up on them, which one my skin needs more. Holy crap. I was not expecting this. Okay, <clears throat> I have two more packages to open, and I know one of them is my order from Wayfair, and then the other one I do not know. <laughs> this might be my order from Vegamore. I'm not sure. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, this is from Kiehl's. Okay, okay, okay. So, I got the Kiehl's new microdose anti-aging retinol serum with ceramides and peptides so they sent over like i think i showed it to you before it's the brew one from kills 
That's so good. I use that every single morning. This is something that you simply apply. Simply apply the retinol morning or night after cleansing. This gentle formula is suitable for first time retinol users and those with sensitive skin. Okay, good. Because I've honestly never used retinol before on my skin. And I was kind of iffy about, say, you know, trying this product. But we'll give it a go and hope that it's good. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Again, this is the Retinol Skin Renewing Daily Microdose Serum um, with a precise daily strength concentration of pure retinol, peptide, and ceramides. So here it is. Let's open it up and see what the packaging looks like. Oh, wow. Okay. Look at that pretty bottle. Oh, it has a pump. Okay, so I will try this out. Um, later on this week, <clears throat> I'm going to have to do some research on this because, again, I'm scared to use it because I've never used retinol on my skin before. So we will see. We will see how it goes. And then my order from Wayfair. I'm so excited. I was just there looking for just random stuff, and this thing popped up on my feed, and I was like, ooh. I'm not going to lie. It took me a few weeks to finally decide, all right, we're going to buy this because... One, I already have bathroom accessories and trays and stuff like that. So it's not something that we need. Um, and two, they're pricey. So I was like, mm, I don't know. But ultimately, I went and purchased it, obviously, because I just absolutely love it. And I feel like the bathroom things that we have now, which I'll show you later, I mean, they're pretty, but they don't match. You know what I mean? Like, And I want something that just matches. So, I got all these and I'm excited. All right, so this item is actually what made me wanna buy from this collection. It is the tray. I absolutely love it. I love the white and blue design. It reminds me of like Chinisari, um items and like vases. So, I got that. I actually have two, so one for me and one for Tom. And all of this is porcelain, you guys. So I love that. And they do have um, little things in the bottom right there. So it's not going to scratch your granite countertops or whatever. Um, I'm really excited about this. It's so pretty. I think the trays were around $27. They were on sale. Um, and then I purchased the tumbler. Because I need a place to put um, my makeup brushes in. So, yeah. Just the pattern is so pretty. Again, these are all porcelain. Um, yeah, I don't know. It just says... That's just what it says. I will link all of it below. It's all from Wayfair. Um, yeah, I just... I love that. And then lastly is the soap dispenser. I did actually purchase a toothbrush holder, which is super similar to what we have now, but... Um, the new one will fit Liam's toothbrush because Liam's toothbrush right now is just like sitting next to the toothbrush holder. <laughs> I don't know. Um, but that's not here yet, so I can't show you that. But I'll link it below or I'll pop a photo here so you can see. Um, and then later on, I'll show you the one that we have now. You can kind of compare. It's really similar. Um, but anyways, this is the uh, soap dispenser. So same pattern as the tumbler. It's so pretty has the chrome right there so it will match the um the hardware in our bathroom so i am so excited to put these in our bathroom i know like they're just bathroom accessories but little things i feel like really makes a difference in your home you know what i mean so anyways that is it that is all that i have here to unbox and share with you um and yeah i'm gonna go ahead and put them away and then um, i'll show you later on once I do the bathroom and stuff like that, um, I'll show you um, how I organize it and all that.
All right, you guys, so here is the bathroom or a divinity area with the new bathroom accessories organizers. I love them. I think they look so good. Again, I'm gonna be getting a new like toothbrush holder thing. So Liam's stuff has a spot because as you can see right now, there is no spot in there. But for now, there you go. Super cute. I love it. I love the white and blue so, so, so much. And then I did end it up organizing this area as well. So I believe I showed you guys how I organized this last time, um, like a few months ago, I think. Uh, but yeah, I guess, you know, used the new organizers from Target as I showed you. And they're like really bendy as you can see here. So you can really squish them to like fit certain areas. So I have three of these guys in here. And I guess have it organized that way. This is my little sponge. This is like a silicone cup from the Dollar Spot in Target. And I just put my sponge in there. I wash it almost every every other day. Um, and then I organize this as well. It doesn't look super organized, but it is. So I have my makeup here in the front that I always like reach for. My epilator body lotion that I love and then my other skincare so um some of these are already open um but i just don't want them all out here you know i just want my pretty much like the necessities out on the counter so i have some of them done there with my mask and then this is just like, bags and this is the towel that i put my makeup brushes on when i wash them just stuff like that i also kind of organized this right here so these are bins from target so i just have curling iron and this has my blow dryer and brush and this is all my hair stuff that I love and the toothbrush for my baby hairs <laughs> and you guys know the other side is my husband so I'm not gonna go show you that but that is it I absolutely love these so much this makes me so happy also love these towels I got these last year I think or the year before from Target and I can't find them anywhere else I'm kind of sad. They don't have them anymore either. I wish I would have bought a few sets of them. But yeah, you can see the towels behind me, like the big towels. But anyways, that is that for the bathroom. Super happy with my purchase. Love it. <laughs> this is so random. But I also got us a new garbage can for our master bathroom. It's so pretty. It's like that copies shell. See that? And this was like, oh, there's the price. $14.99 home goods I love it I just had like a normal white one here before but now it's all nice and pretty and I feel like it goes with the bathroom aesthetics right it's so pretty I love it again loves it is the next day i totally forgot to end the vlog yesterday because after i did the bathroom um we just had dinner and just really tried to relax and i tried to also get screenshots of my island because i'm working on something with grace so i got screenshots of my island let me show you I have like a lot of screenshots. Oh, it's not on here. I'm gonna show you on my phone. It didn't, um, what's it called? It didn't go onto my laptop. 
but um, I got like screenshots of my Animal Crossing Island so I can draw parts of it um, for a little sticker kit um, that we're trying to do. And yeah, so today I'm going to be drawing, um, aside from editing this vlog and putting it up, I'm going to be drawing and actually working on orders because I do have a few orders. And by the way, yes, I am wearing the same pajamas. I wear my pajamas twice before I get a new one. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, I hope you guys like seeing the bathroom. I woke up today and it just looks so nice and clean. Everything looks matchy-matchy. I absolutely love it. Um... I have other things um, coming up. Like I ordered a few things on Williams and Sonoma and Mackenzie Childs uh, because I really, I've been stuck on what I want to do with the coffee bar. I kind of have like a certain vision for it and I'm like, I just want Mackenzie Childs items. Like I am so over Ray Dunn, you guys. It's sad. Like there's a few items um, that I kept from Ray Dunn, but for the most part, I don't want to collect that. I'd rather collect Mackenzie Childs. And I know that's like expensive, but the quality is so there. So anyways, yeah, I ordered a few things for the coffee bar and I'm so excited for that to arrive. Um, and then we can do a new coffee bar setup. I've been wanting to do a bee theme. So I have a few things for already, but there's one item that I ordered from Williams and Sonoma that I wanna use. And then everything else I ordered is for like fall and winter and I'm so excited. So anyways, I don't know what else to do. Um, I have my planner here and I'm literally about to plan out my days. I didn't plan out this week at all. Like this was last week, look at me go. I have been planning since our launch, last launch because I realized before that I was so lost. So if you have a planner and you haven't touched it yet and you feel kind of lost and like your mind is everywhere, get your planner out, just jot it, things down. It doesn't need to look pretty or anything like that. Literally, you can just write whatever like I, I decorated this month since I did the plan with me with you guys, but the, the week after that, I was like, eh, I just want to jot things down. So, I mean, I added a few stickers, but not a whole lot, you know, like even just a little bit of stickers for color, but really it does not need to look pretty. You just need to write it down. It will help so, so, so much. Um, but yeah, that is... That is it, you guys. I think I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here because, like I said, I have to get things going um, on this new collection. And, yeah. By the way, there is a giveaway going on right now over on my Instagram. If you love planners, I am giving away a planner, a super adorable planner with accessories. Also, Grace is kind enough to ship in like $25 shop credit for a shop so definitely check it out i'll have it linked below and yeah go join all right bye guys thank you so much for watching and i will see y'all soon on thursday bye